Hey everyone, Time Rider here. You know, people ask me all the time if I have a favorite casting. Um, you know, since 1968, uh, Hot Wheels has created 800 castings and 11,000 variations. And for Matchbox, it gets even more complicated because of a change of ownership. Suffice it to say that somewhere between 1 and 125 models have been on the market since the 50s. So how can I have a favorite? But there's always castings that I would like to do, like this 32B Jaguar E-Type, manufactured by Lesney from 1962 until 1965, and sold until 67. It was re-released in the early 2000s as a part of a Heritage Classic series and uh, the best of the British collection. An actual E-Type back in 1961, when they were first produced, would run about $5,000. Jaguar produced them until 1974, and they remained pretty much cosmetically similar throughout three different series of the car. I've done this car before, and it was an irony because Marty and I each released a custom version of this casting on the same day in May of 2019. We chose each to make it a race car, and we recreated our versions of British Racing Green. Uh, my original casting back then was so corroded it was impossible to restore. This particular casting wasn't much better, and I didn't realize until I stripped it how much of the casting detail was gone. Restoring it would have been out of the question, so I decided to file off what was left of the details and polish it. Uh, but there were some pits in the hood that I just couldn't get rid of, and that would have shown through the translucent paint. So I just primed it with du Duplicolor White and used Duplicolor Rattlecan Red, followed by a couple coats of Minwax Clear. Everything else got a good cleaning. The interior was painted in a flat camel color. The new window piece was from a vendor with whom I've had issues before with their glass fitting. And true to form, this one does not quite fit. But there you have it, the Matchbox number 32B Custom. Some other things I have going on are the Matchbox number 29E Racing Mini. I'll be painting this one red, not orange, and I had to make my own decals for it. Uh, if you watched my Hateful Tampos video, you'll recognize this, the Nova panel. Uh, I've stripped it, so I might as well do something with it. I did change the primer color to white and took the Matchbox wheels off of it. I'm certain that I have something better for it than that. I joke with others that when I die, my castings will end up in a yard sale or a bin. Uh, I've always kept track of where my castings went, and that's the Red States. And so to that end, I want to see if I can send a casting to each of the 50 states. I'll be giving away castings every, uh, periodically, regularly I'll even say. Anyone in the United States is eligible. Just make a comment, this van's rocking, don't bother knocking, whatever you want to say. Something to indicate uh, that you'd like to have one of my castings. And, you know, you can collect it, you can smash it with a BFH, do whatever you want. When I publish the racing mini video, I'll give it away and send it to you. I'll pay the postage and initial the bottom. I hope you liked the video. This is Time Rider, and I'll leave the light on for you.